All right, what's up guys? Hey, before this video starts, I did just wanna go ahead and shout out my friends in the band Mood Swings. Not only do I genuinely enjoy the band, but they've been nice enough to sponsor videos in the past, so I wanted to give them a real quick shout out here at the beginning of the video. If you guys would like to skip this, go ahead. I will put the timestamp right here for the actual mass content. But like I said, just wanted to shout out Mood Swings who are debuting their first full length album in the fall. Here is a quick snippet from their new music video, So Much For Celebrating. You were real too. And that full music video actually drops today. So if you guys would like to go check that out, if you happen to like what you hear, make sure to click the link down below in the pinned comment. It is not going to be in the description, only the pinned comment. I am doing this because I'm also promoting an artist mask in this video. So pinned comment for Mood Swings. If you guys like what you heard, make sure to go check them out. And a huge thank you to Mood Swings for their support of the channel in the past. Now, on with the mask unboxing. What is going on ladies and gentlemen, AJ Good here at the House of Masks where we unbox and review cool stuff almost every single day. And when I say almost every single day, I mean almost every single day. We are on a roll yet again. Absolutely killing the game here on YouTube and I could not be happier with how everything is going. I really hope that you guys are enjoying it. It's just a good time. Thank you guys very, very much for being here with me and supporting the channel. I appreciate the shit out of you and with that being said, let's go ahead and jump on into today's video which is an unboxing slash review on something very cool. Now we've got a package here from overseas from an up and coming mask maker that goes by the name of Daniel Cushion. I hope I'm saying that right but I'm probably Probably not, so if I am saying that incorrectly, I apologize, Dan please, please forgive me. Now, Dan hit me up and said that he wanted to send me one of these pieces, and of course, I was not going to say no. It is a Jay Weinberg mask, and as you guys all know, I am gay for Jay, if you will. So he went ahead and sent in his version of a 0.5J mask, but not just any 0.5J mask, my all-time favorite variant of the 0.5J, and that is the Knotfest Japan version. So on top of it being my favorite member's mask, it's also my favorite mask from that member. So it's my favorite mask from my favorite member. That's a lot of words. I waste time, say lot word when few word do trick. I checked out the photos that he sent me and it looked solid, so I'm definitely excited to get on into the package and take a look at what we've got, show it to you guys, and get it in the collection. So we will start off here with this note that's right on top, and it says, Hey AJ, the House of Masks has been a massive inspiration to me, so I wanted to show my appreciation by sending you a 0.5J Weinberg mask. They will be available from my Etsy shop or by contacting me on Instagram at Killer Masks Studios from from Daniel Cushion. P.S. I hate AJ Good. So, of course, I will be dropping Dan's information down below in the description. Make sure to go check him out. Let him know that the House of Masks sent you and maybe he will keep hooking us up with cool stuff. So, right on top here, we have got little business cards. I think they're all the same, but it just shows some of the pieces that he makes there. And then we will go ahead and get on into the mask itself. And this thing looks pretty awesome. So, I got the first look this time. I apologize. It wasn't covered up or anything, but here is the Knotfest Japan J, and like I said, this is my all-time favorite J mask of any era, any variant, definitely the Knotfest Japan version. I don't know why, there's just something very, very cool about it. And I'm actually really, really stoked to have another Japan variant in my collection because the one that I have from Walter is a few years old, and although I do find the sculpt to be really, really nice, the finish on it isn't necessarily super accurate, but I really, really like the finish on it. Like, this is one of those times where I actually prefer Walter's version over a completely accurate variant. I just think that it looks better. So I've never gone in and just reworked that one to make it more accurate. I didn't have the heart to change anything about the mask because I liked it so much. So now, not only do I have a new accurate variation for the collection, but I also have that custom one, if you will, that's a little less accurate, but still very special in my heart. So yeah, just going to let this mask do a little bit of talking for itself. As you can see, this thing is beautiful. We've got a really, really nice sculpt, a very authentic look finish on it. We've got the accurate YKK zipper there. Really, really nice strap work around the sides of the mask. There on the inside you can see that we've got the elastic band there and you can see a little bit of the inside of the mask. It says to AJ from Dan. 
And this will probably make a lot of people happy because I would definitely say that this thing is big head friendly. I don't know if you can tell, but when you hold it next to my head, I'm sure that my head looks pretty small. And not only is that because my head is small, but I think this mask is a little larger than most. Go ahead and try to put it on now. See how big it is on me. Yeah, it feels massive on me, which is not necessarily a bad thing because most people are a little larger than me. That's what she said. So if there are people out there that are looking for a big head friendly J, I would definitely recommend Dan's piece here. This thing is just all around great. I don't have any complaints, no negative criticism whatsoever to give this piece. And I would definitely look forward to getting some other variations in from Dan in the future. So like I said earlier, if you guys would like to go check his mask out, please go do so. I will be dropping all of his information down below. I would like to give a huge thank you to Dan for sending this piece in. I absolutely love it and I appreciate you, sir. Thank you so, so much. And yeah, what do you guys say we go ahead and end this video? As always, I will leave you guys with some nice close-up shots of this piece to let you take in all of the detail. Then we will go throw it out in the collection and show it off there as well. And that will be that for today. So I hope that you guys have enjoyed watching. Thank you very, very much as always. And until next time, this has been AJ Good at the House of Masks telling you to say no to drugs and alcohol and yes to not fest Japan and we will see you guys later.